Good morning, Calvary. I hope everyone is doing well this morning. Well, the day is finally here. During the month of October, you all donated an amazing amount of non-perishable food items in celebration of Harvest Home. Today, we celebrate your tremendous generosity by dedicating the collected food, after which it will be distributed to local food pantries. I also want to thank everyone who made a donation to our annual Thanksgiving meal drive. The grateful families who have received the gift of your generosity will have a wonderful Thanksgiving because of you. Today is the deadline for bringing your donations in, so if you haven't done so already, you better hurry. We're starting two new Small Bites classes for adults. In the office wing classroom, Linda Smith and Emily Dyson will help you to look at different types of prayer. It's an opportunity to expand and deepen your prayer life. In the library, Terry Heron, Pastor Anka, and Carol Raykopf will have a session on the Christmas story where you'll take a closer look at the story of Jesus' birth in the different Gospels. The Faith Boosters theme for the month of November is Advent, the season when we take time to prepare to celebrate the birth of Jesus. Coming up this Tuesday is our monthly Top of the Hill event for the seniors in our community. This is a meal ministry that has really grown over the past several years. It's a great time of fellowship and entertainment, and everyone is welcome. Meal service begins at 12 p.m., and the meal this month is potluck, so bring your best. Good morning, Calvary. It's November, and the holidays are right around the corner, so you know what that means. It's time for Calvary's annual Calvary Christmas Market, Friday, November 17th, 11 a.m. to 7.30 p.m. We will have lots of good food, baked goods, jams and jellies, a wonderful silent auction, cheese balls, white elephants, and local vendors from around the community who will have crafts and other things to sell. Now, this market is really important important it helps to service our debt. We need to be fiscally responsible and we need to keep this wonderful roof over our heads. But it's not all just about the money. I really enjoy when people come into our building from all over the community and they say, we just love coming to your church. Everyone is so welcoming and so friendly. You have so much good food. That really makes me happy. I think that's just as important as the money that we earn. Obviously to do this, we need a lot of help from everyone. You can go on the website, look for everything Christmas and scroll down down to find the Christmas market and sign up there to help. If you're not that computer savvy like me, you can sign up right here on this paper and pen sign up sheet. It will be in the narthex. Our most urgent need is for people to work on Wednesday, November 15th at 1 p.m. That's our preparation day. We make our, our soup and our chicken salad and all those kinds of things and box up all of our candies. That right now, that day is the most important one. Please prayerfully consider how you can help us with this event and come on out for the Christmas market and I'll see you at the bake table. Every Christmas Eve, we decorate the altar with poinsettias. If you would like to purchase a poinsettia for the altar, please contact Kim Smithson, our parish administrator. You may take your poinsettia home after the Christmas Eve service that you attend. Separate from the decorations, we are also doing a fundraiser to spread Christmas cheer. Spread Christmas Cheer is a project to help you acknowledge the work done by the unsung heroes in our community. Please navigate to the Calvary website, click on the All Things Christmas link, and then click on the Poinsettias Spread the Gift of Cheer link from the drop-down menu. Calvary will deliver to an organization that is within a 15-mile radius of the church. If you would like to order one for yourself, you certainly may. Just please make sure you pick it up the week after Easter. On Sunday, November 26th, we will have our next intergenerational event, which will be our annual Advent Wreath Workshop. It's one of our most popular events of the year. Come and learn how to make your own Advent Wreath that you can then use throughout the season. We need photographers. We would like to be able to publish more photos of the events that we have here at Calvary. We're not looking for anything fancy. You can use your phone. We just need the pictures. If you're willing to help out, simply send the pictures to Kim Smithson, our parish administrator, following the event. And thanks for your help. In today's sermon, Pastor Anka will be looking at how we are dependent upon God for everything and what it means when we talk about being rich toward God in return. 
Thank you so much for being with us today. We hope you have a great worship experience today that will strengthen you for this coming week. See you next week. Bye-bye.